Hey kittens! Silver here once again with a new video and I'm here with Cookie Dog by Stife as you can see uh, who was also featured in a video of his own um, but I thought I'd bring Cookie out because um, I'm going to be reviewing another Stife plush that I got a couple months back um, as part of my cat collection which is primarily what I uh, what I collect um, as a plush enthusiast so let me just bring up this little kitty and there he is this is Minu the British blue cat by uh, the incredible Stife company which I've really grown to just love and admire over the last year um, some of their earlier plushies like the vintage uh, plush they used to make are a, a little on the uh, creepy side to me, but their newer more modern plushies are so so well made and They're among my favorites in my collection and me knew I just sort of found by by random chance just sort of googling um, Googling different plushies, which is always a dangerous uh, proposition for me because I always end up finding things that I need to buy and me knew was one of them and uh, Minu is actually uh, one of the uh, limited edition plushies that Stife released back, uh, I'm not sure actually what year this was, maybe it's on his tag somewhere. Um, it's, I'm thinking the early 2000s, so um, I didn't expect to find this particular cat since um, it had been such a long time since he'd been retired and um, he was a limited edition to begin with, so it was going to be tricky, but luckily I found um, a dealer through a website called bearattack.com who was able to locate one for me in, uh, in Germany and she had it shipped out to me and it took a very long time I remember for this particular plush, especially um, since you know we've all been dealing with the uh, travel restrictions due to the pandemic, but he finally came and I'm so so happy to have him in, in my collection just because he's really just a one-of-a-kind plushie. I mean, I've, I've never seen um, a cat that looks quite like this. I mean, that there are, you know, there's like, there's British short hair cats, um, there's Russian blue cats, but none that, that look quite like me new here does. So let me just sort of give you a closer look at him. Um, I'll show you his little button and ear tag. So made in Germany by Stife. And all their limited edition ones are also numbered. And I'm actually seeing this some fraying actually at the <laughs> at the end of the tag. But so um but anyway, he is oh okay, so he was um produced in 2008 and he was number 98 out of the um was it I'm not sure, maybe there were two thousand made. I, I oh that's it, two thousand and eight exactly. <laughs> So he was released in 2008, and there were 2008 in stock at the time. So he was number 98. And then you can see his little um, the little tag on his chest here. It's gonna, I don't know if it's going to focus. Okay, made in Germany, Minu, limited edition. And apparently Minu, I, I looked it up, it's um, a French word for, for cat, sort of... Um, Kind of more like a, a cutesy way of saying cat, I guess. Um, and they kind of, I guess, kind of have vulgar connotations based on what I was seeing too. But uh, let's uh, let's not contemplate that for too long. <laughs> okay, so um, so Minu is probably about oh I forget now. It's everything's measured in centimeters, um, but he's a he's a pretty good size. He's he's pretty long. His, um, his legs are particularly long, as you can see, and he's got the little airbrushed paw prints underneath his feet there. And you can see, uh, th this is actually, this is not threading, this is also um, airbrushed marks for his claws. And his whiskers are so cool because um, I don't think I've ever seen another cat plush that has these sort of like silvery blue gray whiskers, which really complement his fur nicely. And his eyes are particularly striking, uh, as you can see. Let's see if I can get a close up so you can see some of the sort of the speckling 
on the inside and you see some nice airbrushing around the eye as well. And that's uh, one of the things I've noticed too about um, Stife just in general is that they really have the most beautiful eyes, all of them, just across the board. And this guy's eyes are almost sort of almost luminous. They're just sort of this really rich orange yellow color. And you can also see the airbrushing on his head. There's sort of a stripe there and two more by his eyes. And he's also got some on either side of his face just to give him a little bit of dimension. So he's not just, you know, just sort of a monochromatic gray color. He's um, He's got this extra detail, which, you know, really adds to his overall charm, I think. And he's got a little bit of airbrushing just above his nose. And the nose is really cool too. I know Stife um, with a few of their cats have done this before where they use this um, this really unique folding technique to make the nose. So it is a fabric nose. It's it's a soft kind of, um, uh, it, it's looking like brown on the camera, but it's really more um, more of a grayish color in real life. And also you see around the rims of the ears, there's some airbrushing as well. And he's weighted with beans in the back. And he's a pretty floppy plush, especially the front feet. They're especially floppy. The, uh, the back feet kind of, um, well, they're floppy too, actually. But he kind of, um, but they kind of stay in, a, in, in one position without moving too much. I mean, you can sort of, yeah, if you want to, you could, you could sort of stretch them out like this. But they're really meant to just sort of be um, kind of angled like that. And he's got a good long sized tail as well. And the fur on Minu is very, it's very thick, like very substantial. I don't think it's, um, I'm not sure if it's a, it's a plush material that they use, um, but whatever it is, it's, it's very, um, it's, it's very substantial. Like I said, it's, um, it's got, a, it's got a lot of thickness to it, but it feels really nice. It feels really realistic as well. Like as if, you know, I'm really, <laughs> like I've got a real cat just perched up here. So isn't he a handsome guy? <laughs> and he's got such a good face too. He's, he's so well proportioned. He's kind of got one ear that flops over a little bit, which kind of gives him a little extra character as well. And he's got these really long legs. And, uh, He's um, a British blue cat, which I believe is just a color variant of the British short hair cat. Uh, they're often mistaken for Russian blues um, because they do share a lot of similarities. They look very similar. Um, <laughs> my mom actually thought that he he looked a lot like Church from the original Pet Cemetery movie, but <laughs> I think he's much cuter and much less frightening than that. So. <laughs> um, so anyway, yeah, that's that's me new. So I thought I'd uh, give you guys a, a chance to to take a look at him since um, he's in very short supply. And uh, I hope you enjoyed seeing me new. And I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for watching.